found out about this fellow who had done projects with students. He had gone to Trinidad and Tobago and had started an inner city steel drum band that had become pretty well known in the city. And um, I encouraged him to come and talk to us and see uh, about joining our staff. When he started, he was a language arts social studies teacher in the middle school. And he, we had a little before school steel, steel drum band, a little volunteer group. Uh, just kind of on a volunteer, whoever was interested basis. And uh, gradually that program grew. Um, and at every grade level now there's a full size steel band. One of the important things too, when you're starting a new school, at least where we live, there's competition for secondary programs. So we had to create uh, this idea of who are we that people will pay attention to that differentiates us from other programs. Some of the effects have been that we've brought together disparate groups of people who might not otherwise uh, be working together. So folks from different communities playing in the same band, uh, a lot more involvement with uh, special needs students. I think the steel band is a really good vehicle for music in the middle school and high school because the students get to move a tremendous amount while they're playing. They have the opportunity not just to learn a variety of uh, genres of music because we play classical, calypso, spiritual music, um, popular music, but they also get an opportunity to be moving and interacting while they're practicing and playing. I think there's a lot of uh, vitality in that and a lot of energy that you can incorporate into an ensemble like Steel Band. And I think that just makes it particularly suitable for this age level. One thing that's really nice about Steel Band music is that you can arrange it yourself so that there are some parts that maybe are relatively simple and some that are extremely difficult within the same piece. And that flexibility allows you to incorporate students at a variety of levels. So it's kind of differentiated instruction in terms of difficulty. So we play everything from beginning in seventh grade. We'll play the very simplest Calypso style pieces and some uh, gentle, easier classical pieces up to uh, where the seniors, juniors and seniors, are playing pieces that are as difficult as things played at any university in the country then helping people also understand that along with field studies and steel band and these other amazing, cooperative, wonderful uh, things that we were doing, we were also going to be um, having high quality academics. So that's a lot, that's a lot. And eventually as we continue to deliver those things, people realize it's true, we're not just making it up. So if you build it, they come.